At the start of the COVID-19 pandemic, one saint has been invoked, over and over, by many citizens of Palermo, to protect their city. Her name is Saint Rosalia. The Roman Catholic Church celebrates her feast day every September 4th. Rosalia was born of a Norman noble family that claimed descent from Charlemagne. In her youth, her heart turned from earthly vanities to God. She practiced great mortifications and lived in constant communion with God. Devoutly religious, she retired to live as a hermit in a cave on Mount Pellegrino, about three miles from Palermo, in order to triumph entirely over the instincts of flesh and blood, inside of her paternal home. She died alone, in 1160, ending her strange and wonderful life unknown to the world. The city of Palermo was beset with plague in 1624. During this time, tradition retold the story of how Rosalia first appeared to a sick woman. Later, she appeared to a hunter, to whom she indicated where her remains were to be found. In this vision, Rosalia asked the hunter to bring her bones to Palermo and have them carried in procession through the city. The hunter climbed Mount Pellegrino and found Rosalia's bones inside the cave. On the walls were written, I, Rosalia, daughter of Cinebald, Lord of Roses and Quisquina, have taken the resolution, to live in this cave, for the love of my Lord, Jesus Christ. The hunter did what she had asked in the apparition. After her remains were carried around the city three times, the plague ceased. After this, Rosalia was venerated as the patron saint of Palermo, and a sanctuary was built in the cave, where her remains were discovered. In Palermo, a major social and religious event in the city called the Festino di Santa Rosalia is held each year on July 14 and continues into the next day. Every September 4, a tradition of walking barefoot from Palermo up to the sanctuary of Santa Rosalia high up on Mount Pellegrino is observed in honor of Saint Rosalia. Flemish Baroque artist Anthony van Dyck, who became the leading court painter in England, is said to have lived in Palermo during the 1624 plague and produced the most paintings of Saint Rosalia. His depictions, a young woman with flowing blonde hair, wearing a Franciscan cowl and reaching down toward the city of Palermo in its peril, became the standard iconography of Rosalia from that time onward. For more information about every saints and their feast day, please like and subscribe to our channel, House of Prayers for Everyone.